Hey guys, this is Tamman here doing love and welcome to a very interesting ep episode and video today. With it being Christmas season, just having Thanksgiving a couple weeks ago and Halloween a month ago, I thought it would be perfect to do a holiday tier list maker. For those who don't know, here are the holidays, so we have, I don't think I'm going to include Black Friday, but we have the mainstays. New Year, Valentine's Day, St. Patrick's Day, Easter, 4th of July, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and I'll rank them. S being the best, D being the worst. Let's get into it with New Year's. New Year's, I think, kind of gets overshadowed a bit, but I really do like the holiday. For me, I've always had fun counting down the New Year's celebration with my family, talking about what our plans are for the new year, you know, making goals. I like that part of it. I think the holiday has kind of this, you know, themes of kind of this blue, this kind of renewed sense. It's a nice time of reflection. I just think it's very short. After Christmas, we have New Year's. I do think this is a nice B tier holiday. It's fun to celebrate, but then you kind of move on with life. Valentine's Day, I have a lot of thoughts on. I think the idea of love is a cool idea. You know, it's great to love people. But I think the holidays become a bit misconstrued in how it's executed. Basically, what I'm trying to say is, you know, it's very much about romantic love with couples. And I think... You know, people who are not in a relationship, whether they choose to be or they're just not, feel left out because, you know, Valentine's Day is love to family and friends. Whoever it may be, non-romantic love is a big part, but I think it's overshadowed. I think, you know, commercialism plays a big part in this holiday. I think this is a C-tier holiday. Next up, St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day is a very interesting holiday. Because for me, all these other holidays, we kind of have themes. Renewment, love, thankfulness, joy. St. Patrick's Day doesn't really have a theme. However, it's been really fun whenever I celebrate with my family. We've always done cool stuff. It's just kind of a fun holiday where you can get out there and have fun and wear green. Because, you know, it's you know neat with the Irish traditions with the leprechauns and stuff. And I had fun with that when I was a kid. But ultimately, the lack of meaning, I think, will bump it down. I'm going to put this in B tier, but I think if it had some meaning, it would probably go up uh, a couple tiers. Easter, I think, is between A and S. I really love Easter, not only for the religious meaning, but just the kind of way it feels. Everyone dresses up nice, you have this formal sense. It's during the spring, so it feels very refreshing and nice, and I really love Easter, the different ways to go about it. Now, even if someone is non-religious, I feel like the, you know, baby bunnies and um, baby chickens are a good way to represent the spring feeling of refreshment. It's a holiday that even if you're not religious, you can still enjoy fun times with family and friends. This is a nice time, I feel like, you know, kind of early in the year to see family and then you see them at Christmas. I think it's an A-tier holiday. The only reason I don't have an S-tier is I just feel like the com the candy is a bit too much. Um, you know, the commercialism still been in effect, but I'll go A. Fourth of July, I'm, I'm going to go A. I really, you know, it's a great time where, you know, America, everyone comes together. Um, you know, it's been great in years past, you know, you know, swimming, barbecuing, having fun, you know, just enjoying summer. I think, you know, Easter really embodies sp spring. Fourth of July embodies summer. Um, for me, I think this year was big because, you know, there's a lot of things going on in the country with 4th of July, but I feel like everyone just kind of stopped and was thankful for the country we're in and stuff. It's a great patriotism holiday. It has themes with the colors. So I think it's A tier. Halloween is probably my favorite holiday. I just love it because there's many different ways you can celebrate. If you love being scared and gore, you can do that. There's movies you can watch. Or if you like me, enjoy more of the simple stuff for Halloween. This nice stuff like that too. It's a fun holiday where you can dress up and I feel like really be yourself. It's just a really cool holiday. I like the placement of it too. You know, usually, you know, I've been in school and the first half of the year you have a lot of holidays. But then after 4th of July, there's no major holidays. You have a day off here and there, such as Labor Day, Veterans Day. And I do love those holidays to, you know, honor those people. But you don't really get a big holiday. So I think something like Halloween, just to make things fun, it has that fall area, is really cool. And now I want to go to Thanksgiving, which I think is also an A-tier holiday. I would have it between Easter and 4th of July. 
I think the stuff about Thanksgiving is the coziness, the warm, the dessert, the food. It's really great and all. But my issue with Thanksgiving is that it just is really bookended by Halloween and Christmas and Black Friday. And I really don't feel like you really have the opportunity to really fully experience it. Also, there's a lot of prep to do. I do love the holidays, meanings, and traditions. I do have fun with it, but I have it in A tier. I think, you know, I like it more than 4th of July, but I like Easter more than Thanksgiving. Those two, I think, are really close. A lot of people would like to compare Halloween and Christmas, but for me, I think Easter and Thanksgiving are very comparable as well. Christmas is going to go in S tier. It's between this and Halloween. For me, the thing with Easter is, you know, the religious reasons. But I just love the season, you know, the um, music, hot chocolate, sing lights, the movies. It's all classic. The thing for me is, though, that Christmas Day itself is fine. You know, I just usually hang around and stuff. So Christmas Eve is fantastic. The whole season's fabulous, but the day itself is good. So I do think it's still S tier. So that is it, everyone. So it goes Halloween, Christmas, Easter, Thanksgiving, 4th of July, New Year's, St. Patrick's Day, and Valentine's Day. Overall, let me know your thoughts. Oh, I thought it would be a fun video here. Until then, I'll see you all next time. This is Tam and Doing Love. Take care and have a good one.